Hi friends, this is Gayatriya. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to recreate this Bengali look of Bollywood actress Jacqueline Fernandez from her music album named Genda Fool. You can also spot this makeup look for upcoming Bengali festival of Durga Puja. So let's get started. I have already cleansed, toned and moisturized my face, the link of which I have provided in the description box. Here I am using a few drops of Nykaa's Argan Oil to prime my face. To color correct, I am using Pro Conceal Concealer from Elegal in orange shade to lighten the dark areas on my face and blending it out with a damp beauty sponge. Next I am concealing it with a concealer from LA Girl Pro Conceal in shade Creamy Beige and blending it out with another damp beauty sponge. After blending the concealer, I will be dragging the same beauty blender over my eyelids to make it appear little lighter without taking any product. Next I will be using HD Liquid Foundation from PSE in shade 2.5. This is one of my favorite HD liquid foundation which gives you flawless finish and a very good coverage. You can check out all the products I have used in this tutorial in the description box. Make sure you take small amount of foundation on your beauty blender at a time and blend it with tapping method until you get the desired coverage. Also drag the same beauty blender on your neck and eyelids. Next we will be starting with the eye makeup. For base I am using cream eyeshadow from BND in pink and applying all over my lid. Next I am using these two shades from Huda Beauty Rose Gold Edition palette and with the help of a small blending brush creating a crease. Now I am coloring the corners of my eyes with this violetish pink color with the help of a flat shading brush. Here I have used this colorful palette from Miss Rose. Now blend it with a small blending brush to merge it with the base. Next I am using a shimmery shade called Moon Dust from Huda Beauty palette to cover 3 4th area of my eyelid. For this I am using a jumbo eyeshadow flat brush. After this I will be shaping and filling my eyebrows with Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Drop Pomade in shade Ebony. I am outlining and filling it with the help of a flat angular brush and spreading with a mascara brush to even it out. For eyes I am using a cold pencil from BND to roughly outline my upper lash line and smudging it out with a smudger. Next I am using a white eye pencil from NYX to outline my waterline. To highlight my eyebrow bone I am using nylon shade from MAC and highlighting it with a small blending brush. Next I am using a liquid concealer from MAC in shade NC20 to highlight my under eyes, nose bridge, forehead, chin and the sides of my jaw. Blend this out with the help of a damp beauty blender until no harsh edges are seen. Next I am going to use Lakme Whitening Rose Powder to bake the under eye highlight. Just apply it very loose handedly with the help of a small powder brush. Next I am going to outline my lower lash line with the help of a brown pencil from Lakme. And smudging out this as well with the help of a smudger. Next 
Next I am using a liquid eyeliner from MAC to outline my upper lash line. Next to give softer look to my lower lash line, I will be smoking it out with the help of a small pencil brush and a brown eye shadow from Huda Beauty palette. After this I am curling my natural lashes with the help of an eyelash curler and a mascara from Milk Makeup. Also curl down your lower lashes with the same mascara wand. I'm done with the eye makeup so I'll just wipe off all the loose powder. For contouring I'm using this liquid concealer from LA Girl Pro Conceal in shade Beautiful Bronze. I'm applying it to the sides of my nose, sides of my cheeks, my jawline and my forehead. To blend this I'm using a toothbrush like makeup brush and blending it out as shown in the video. Next I'm going to merge the sharp edges of contouring with the highlight with the help of a damp beauty blender. Next I'm using a contour powder from Wet n Wild to give more finished look to my contours. For my cheeks I'm using an orange color blush from Shani Cosmetics. Next I'm going to outline my lips with the help of a pinkish maroon lip pencil from Maybelline. To fill my lips I'm using a nude shade Kinda Sexy from MAC. Make sure you do not merge the outline with the nude lip color. To highlight my cheekbones I'm using the same shade nylon that I used for my eyebrow bones. Next I'm using lashes from Huda Beauty. And to stick them on, I'm using a lash glue from Ardell. To blend my entire makeup, I'm using a compact powder from MAC Studio Fix in shade NC35. And blending it out with the help of a big powder brush. After giving one last final touch up of liquid liner, I will be setting my makeup with the help of a makeup fixing spray from MAC. So we are done with the makeup and here is the final look where I have curled my hair using a conical tongue and spotting a red bindi, red bangles, a jewellery and a red sari to match my look with that of Jacqueline. Please do let me know in the comment section how did you find my tutorial. You can follow me on my Instagram and Facebook pages to check more of my work, the link of which I have provided in the description box. Thank you so much for watching. If you loved my video, please do like, share and subscribe to my channel for further updates. Till then, goodbye.